A common worry amongst people getting started with Google Docs is what happens if I don't have access to my documents? Uh, is it possible? Is everything stuck in Google Docs? And, and if could I just lose it? How do I back up my work? Well, Google offers a very, very quick and easy way for you to back up your work and actually download files just as easily as you can upload them. Let's take a look. Again, I'm on my Google Docs homepage and I'm going to look for my sample folder. I have two documents in my sample folder I want to download. So I'm going to select the folder and then under more actions, I'm going to click on more actions and choose export. Now it opens up a pop-up window that basically talks about how I can download it because it asks me questions. What do I want to do? Uh, they're, these files are going to be compressed into a zip compressed file and download as one file then you can unzip it when you get it onto your computer. My document was a text document. It's asking me do I want to download as an HTML web file, as an open document, as a PDF, as a rich text format document, as a plain text document, a Microsoft Word document, or just don't, don't download that one. I don't want that one. I'm actually going to say make this one a Word document. And then the presentation says, what do you want me to download this as? I can download it as a PDF file instead of a presentation file. I can download as a PowerPoint file, as a text file, and again, I can also skip this file. I'm going to choose PowerPoint. And then it's going to, I can export two gigs. It says I can export all of my files if I was going to back up my entire group. I have quite a few, and I've done this, and they still were no clo not even close to 2 gigs. But uh, I can back up the entire collection. Let me hit continue, because now we're going to actually go through the process. And now it's taking my files, zipping them into a file, and now it's giving me a download screen on my Mac, and I'm going to say save the file. Now, let me check here and I'm going to pull up a window. Here's my downloads folder. Here is my sample folder in a zip format. I'm going to double click that to unpack it. Now I have my folder. I open sample folder and here are the two documents inside which exactly match. Let me go back here, close this. If you look at sample folder and it looks just like what we downloaded. So if I go back here to my uh, downloads folder, I have my Moodle Explain with Lego SlideShare and my Moodle Explain with Lego document. And if I open this document, this will open uh, Word. Let's do that real fast. So you can see it converted my text document to a Word document. Should have had this open ahead of time. So sorry, I did not practice good cooking show mentality here. And here we go. It's now a Word document in dire need of real formatting. Okay, let me get rid of that. So, now you see an opportunity here to not only upload your documents into Google so you can use them in a collaborative manner, but you can also download your documents on a regular basis to your hard drive so that if you're worried about backing up and having access, which is always a good idea, you know how to do that now.